Hey, what's up, geeks? Uh, Deron Brown here, and I'm your instructor from Geek Mode, the School of React Native. And in this video, we're going to cover the algorithm climbing stairs. Now, I'm on Leak Code's website, and you guys, if you want to follow along, um, just check out the link in the description, and you guys can actually uh, go to his website. So anyways, um, let me read the description. You are climbing a staircase. It takes n steps to reach the top. Each time, you can either climb to one or two steps, and how many distinct ways you can climb to the top. Given the number, given n will be the positive integer. So check out the few examples that we have. We have, uh, as example one, we have our input of two and the output of two. And here's the explanation. There are two ways to climb to the top. That is, we can either climb to the top of the stair of a two staircase by one by one, which is one plus one, or we can just jump to the second step. Sometimes, um, I know when I'm climbing stairs, I'll actually step, I'll skip a step and just go up. So anyways, and then the next example, we can see if the input is three, the output will be three as well. There are three ways to climb to the top. Fair enough. So let's actually get into our algorithm. I want you guys to make sure you copy the code here and then um, go back to your ID or your text editor. Now, once you're in your, uh, your text editor, Let's start things off. We're going to create two variables. Our first variable variable is going to be a. And we're going to set it equal to one. Our next variable is going to be b, and we're going to set that equal to one as well. Now we're just going to make a regular uh, for loop. So if excuse me for let i equal zero, and if i is less than n, we're going to increment our i. Now we're going to let our temporary variable equal a, and we're going to let a plus a, we're going to let a equal a plus b, and b is going to be set to the temporary value. So basically, we are switching. Hold on, guys. I just had this huge spider, so you know I'm going to pause this video. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> and, uh, that spider has been obliterated. So anyways, let's get back into it. Uh, I think it'd be cool to keep that in there. So anyways, <laughs> we're going to return B, all right? So that's the end of our algorithm. So what I'm going to go, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to console log right here, console log our temp. And then next we're going to console log. Hey, what's up guys? Deron Brown here. I just wanted to remind you, at the end of this video, make sure you check out the website www.geekmode.tech. They can learn more about React Native, Firebase, and Redux. And also, if you haven't already, make sure you check out our free course as well. I'm sure you enjoy it. Now, that's enough of me, and I'll let you guys get back to the video. Our console log A. Actually, it's console log A and B. Console log A and B. And I want to console log A and B before we actually hit it. So before... And after. Okay. So I remove this one. And now let's check out B. It's so console log B by itself. And we're, we're returning B anyway, so I'll say this is our return. All right, so let's run our code. We code that was climbing stairs. Whoa, 
one second. Uh, typed in the wrong name, so clear. So anyways, our temporary value is going to be 1 because A or B can be equal to 1. So before A is equal to 1 and then after, after you can see what our values are, A is actually equal to, afterwards A is equal to 2. And we're looping through this, this array entirely right now. So A is equal to 2. First A is equal to 1, then A is equal to 2. And our temporary value is equal to 2. And then before, once A is equal to 2 again, then A equals 3. But we're going to return 2 because 2 is what B is actually uh, equal to. And this is what we wanted. We want to see how many times, uh, how many ways you can step up a 2, step up a 2 staircase. So let's delete our console logs. I'm still kind of, I think it's kind of funny, a spider jumped in <laughs> in the middle of our video. I actually tried to kill that spider a little bit earlier and it, it fell between my bed and the wall and I guess it came back for revenge, but you know, can't phase me. So anyways, copy your algorithm and I want you guys to come, go back to lead code and paste it in. We're going to run our code. Hey, what's up, guys? So I actually, um, I redid the algorithm. I want to see if there was a better way to do it because um, the, the problem is that we're actually getting the right answer. It's just there's an um, order of magnitude error. Basically, it's, it's taking too long for the algorithm to process. And uh, I promise you, this passed before. But for no reason, it's not passing. So if you guys can get past the runtime error, I would love to hear your submission. But anyways, uh, have a good one, geeks, and I'll check you guys later. Peace.